Hey, what is going on viewers? Zesty Lime Studios here and welcome back to a, another drinks review. Today we're viewing another monster, but this one is gonna be on the Monster Rehab and this one is gonna be on the Raspberry Tea flavor. So I got this particular drink out of Molly's Sweet Shop. Again, I'll put it on the screen there for a second. You can go and check her out and have a look. She's got loads of uh, different American monsters and other sweets and candy on there. Definitely worth checking out because that's where I got this from. It was only £3.99, which is actually not that bad, seeing as you can pay £2 for like an English can of Red Bull or Monster in a service station. So £3.99, four quid, really not that bad, seeing as it's imported and they've got to make a profit and delivery. So really not too bad. So anyways, let's give you guys a full 360 of the can. So I've always liked the rehab kind of can designs and they're more towards, they remind me more of the older cans, kind of how the old designs used to be on the monsters. These, the rehabs have kind of kept their, I guess, kind of classic monster formula on the can where they generally have kind of, I don't know how to explain it, but kind of there's more of a separation from the front at the bottom to the top of the can. Because if you look on a lot of the new monsters now, they've kind of got artwork going up all the way and down the side. So this is kind of a, kind of just more of the classic design. If you, if you look at the old cans on my wall up there, which you can't see, you kind of know what I mean. Uh, but yeah, so we have a nice, most of the can is black. And then we have this awesome kind of, I guess, cloud looking effect on the front. And it's got this kind of nice purpley and red colour. And it looks really, really good. It looks really, really nice and bright against the uh, black background. And we have the monster and logo in black as well. On the back, we just have the ingredients and stuff, which are in a, uh, I think it's a shiny silver. Yep, shiny silver. And then we have quite a long story there, which we'll get to in a second. So that's definitely a longer story. I mean, look how small the font is on that. That's pretty long. On the bottom, we have nothing. And on the top, everything's all finished in a nice black, apart from the pull ring, which is in a nice shiny red with the M logo, monster logo on the pull ring. Taking a close look at the drink. So this is non-carbonated because it's tea. Uh, so, quick disclaimer, I find tea disgusting and vile. I think it's the worst drink on the planet. So, this drink review might be a little bit biased, but of course, I will, you know, for you people that like tea, because I know a lot of people do like tea, I will obviously describe it best for you guys that do like tea. So, yeah, non-carbonated, uh, contains 2% apple juice. Okay, raspberry. Uh, tea may settle, shake gently. Yes, we will shake it gently. So, these are actually really low sugar. So this has only got 25 calories and the total, and again, we have nutritional facts rather than information because it's American. So we have total sugars, five grams, including five grams of added sugar. So only five grams of sugar, which is actually really, really low. Uh, we have some vitamins, quite a lot of vitamins actually, calcium, potassium, niacin, vitamin B6 and B12, penicillin acid, phosphorus and magnesium. Uh, let's see. Um, contains coconut okay uh, and caffeine contain is 170 milligrams per can and this is the 458 milliliter can if you're wondering not the 500 mil cans you generally get in England right let's read this long story here at Monster we're all about the work uh, work it's kind of hard to read actually on this reflective thing we're all about the work hard, play hard mentality. And after going all out, we can use a recharge now with Rehab, Rehab Raspberry Energy Iced Tea. There's no reason why bouncing back shouldn't taste amazing. Blending the classic taste of raspberry iced tea with the rejuvenating Rehab Energy Blend, Rehab Raspberry Energy Iced Tea packs a triple threat that quenches first, fires you up, and this is the perfect choice after a hard day's night. Rehab raspberry tea plus energy refresh, rehydrate and revive, or in other words, rehabilitate with a killer mix of raspberry tea, electrolytes and our badass monster rehab energy blend. <sighs> That's quite a long story. So yeah, it's basically raspberry tea. But anyways, it's nice and cold. I have got a drink. So I have got a cup, not a drink. Let's get straight into it. Hopefully it won't explode over me. So I will shake it gently. It shouldn't explode because it's non-carbonated anyway. So, you know, we'll see about that. Right, and someone seems to be cutting down the tree outside. If you can hear that, I do apologize. The window is shut. There we go. So that's gently, so I'm gonna give that another shake. So I'm guessing the color is going to be, I don't know, I wanna guess red, but tea is just generally the brown like it's dirty tap water so i'm guessing it's gonna be some nasty brown color but i could be wrong 
Anyway, let's go and get it open. Oh, blimey. There we go. And the colour is. Ew. Okay. Apple juice colour basically, but I know it tastes of tea, that's why I'm going uh. So yes, the colour is indeed apple apple colour and it's maybe a there's quite a lot of um it's quite a lot of small bubbles in there. Look at that guys, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but it's kind of clear at the bottom and then it's still got the the small bubbles have gone to the top. Look at that. That's pretty uh it's pretty cool. So yeah, apple colour, maybe a tad on the darker side than some of the other kind of you know apple juices you get but for the most part i guess tea can look like that depending how much milk you put in it but for the most part it's just the apple apple color like i said it's non-carbonated and there seems to be no bits in there because we've given it a good shake so let's give it a closer smell now and see what it smells like hopefully it doesn't stink of tea oh okay it actually smells of raspberries it actually smells quite nice okay i cannot smell tea at all which is good which is good for me for people that like tea it doesn't smell of tea but for me personally i doesn't like tea it doesn't smell of tea so i like the smell it smells quite of a really it smells like a little kind of raspberry sweet kind of little sweet uh like a sweet sweet uh thing yeah it smells like a little raspberry gummy sweet or something hmm, okay nevertheless guys let's taste some let's hope it tastes better than i think it will Okay. Wow. I was not expecting that at all. Oh my God. Okay. And the reason I like that is because it doesn't taste of tea. Wow. Wow. Okay. Oh, that's actually quite nice. Oh my God. Because it doesn't taste of tea. Okay. Wow. Interesting. So I got that does not taste of tea. I can't believe it. I was so expected something worse. I'm in sh I'm in shock. Let me toss them out the can and then I'll uh, give my views on it. Wow. Okay. So first of all, this is now before I get into the drink. I know this is an American can, and I'm not sure how Americans kind of see English tea or British tea compared to what teas like out in america or whether it's kind of even teas that big out there so when i'm thinking of tea i'm thinking of british tea we get over here which is like really really strong and potent and i said i don't like it but if this is the idea of some kind of american iced tea then fair enough if that's how it's supposed to be but from coming as you know coming from someone that you know, has grown up for parents that have drinking tea all their life and I've smelled it over the years and I've tried it every time and it's just nasty. This is completely different and out of the book. So just bear that in mind, guys, with the drink. So yes, the drink. Uh, it seems to be fairly sweet. Not syrupy, but it seems to have a quite amount of sweetness. Now, for having low sugar, that's kind of kind of incredible that it's got a good amount of sweetness, sweetness in the drink. Like, it feels like it has a lot more sugar in the drink and... It seems like the actual raspberry flavour is a hell of a lot stronger as well than it just being some kind of, you know, almost sugar-free raspberry flavour. So that's the sweetness side to it. But the drink itself, it literally is drinking, like, just a nice raspberry flavour. Now, again, I know iced tea is different to actual tea, and I'm not, I'm not really keen on standard iced tea either. But this is just really nice how they've done this drink, because... You've got a raspberry flavour, but in the background, I guess that's a tea flavour. But the tea flavour is so not like tea, it it just thinks it. I don't know. I don't know what to say. It's just like it doesn't taste like tea at all. So for you guys that love tea and enjoy tea, then or certainly English people that enjoy the tea, then you will not like this drink because it doesn't taste of tea. Hence why I actually quite like this, and I will drink the rest of this drink. But um, let me try a bit more. Like I'm drinking it, and the, the best, probably the best way to describe it is because I don't, again, like because I don't drink much iced tea at all or ever. I think when I have drank iced tea, kind of standard iced tea, I think the best way I can describe this rehab drink is imagine standard normal iced tea, but with like a really weak tea flavour inside of it, which is quite sweet, and then add a 
nice good strong raspberry flavor over the top of that and combine it with monster's own little sweet kick they've put in there this is basically what this monster rehab raspberry tea is and that's probably the best way to describe this drink so yeah i really can't say much more about that it's um yeah i said i'm actually quite impressed with how nice it tastes because the tea flavor just isn't strong so i am impressed i'm impressed with that the i mean some of the other rehabs i've reviewed from years ago i think were a lot worse but this is definitely nice so i mean can't go wrong a nice strong raspberry flavor throughout the whole drink which is nice and sweet like i said seems more seems more sugar than it actually has in the drink um you've got a you know you've got your base iced kind of tea back in but with the strong raspberry flavor and that's pretty much it with the drink and it's nice i love it because it doesn't taste of tea like I mean, if you gave this to someone and say it was just some raspberry fizzy drink or something someone would probably just believe it. they wouldn't think it's meant to be iced tea so you know make what you will of that but nevertheless i like that i'll definitely be enjoying the rest of that can so that gets a thumbs up for me and as always thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe for more drinks reviews and check out my social links below where you find me on instagram tiktok videos and everything else so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you all later